Hebrew trend. This is 11 stamp fifth. This is a way of linking the 11 stances that we just covered into a small sequence that can be practiced. So I'll give you a few examples of different ways of practicing this form. First, the first example is just a simple 11 stances. This also has some basic block and punching techniques as part of the sequence. Fists come to hip breath position. Attention stance. Left hand drops off the waist and circles over the head to a downward parry on the right side. The right foot steps up to horse stance, squatting down and turning over the right fist to a flat fist punch, looking over the top two knuckles of the right hand. Left hand offers the chest by the side of the chest. This is stance number one. Horse. Flat fist punch. Two. Drop the left hand. Shift to a bow and arrow stance. The left hand continues upward as an upward block with the palm. The right hand comes up right below the chin with an uppercut punch. This is stance number two, upward block, uppercut, and bow and arrow stance. Shift back onto right leg. The left hand carries the side of the ear with the palm facing the side of the face. As it sweeps down to the hip, the right hand rotates over and changes to a palm check by the left shoulder. A right vertical punch comes out as cast dance. Thus we have cast dance and sun fist punching. Stand up, lift the left knee, roll the left hand on the inside of the right arm. This becomes a back fist strike. The rolling thunder as a rolling back fist in a crane stance. Step down. The left hand locks in and across as the right hand makes a check. Kneeling down in a wide kneeling stance. And take the left elbow and strike the palm. We have elbow smashing technique with kneeling stance. Opening to a transitional pose. This is a horse stance with double fist. The right hand continues sweeping back. The right toe opens up from the hip. The toes turn out. Left foot slides up, forms high cross twisting. As I sink down, the left foot twists in. The right hand is kept propped up and behind. This is hook fist, twisted stance. The left hand comes to the hip as it shifts back to a horse stance. The right hand sweeps around and stops at the point of the palm facing down at the navel area. I shift 50% of the weight back onto the right leg, tuck the hips under, and strike with an outward and downward expanding fist, 60-40 stance. Shifting the left toe facing forward, the left hand to the waist, the right hand is hammering inward block, coming across the center line. The left hand travels up and makes a twist upward with your cranial block. I shift down 80% onto the left leg and do a pose stance with a shin chopping hammer fist. Slide up into a three power stance, tucking the left leg underneath. The hip, the left hand comes down from above, and the right hand pulls and stops below the elbow for a drilling upper cut fist in three power stance. Thus, drilling stance and three power step. Feet together, left foot stops, the right hand punches straight down in a closed horse stance. This is downward planting fist, closed horse stance, number 10. Stepping out onto the heel to make a uh, seven star step. Left hand chops out. Right hand overhand chop. Strikes the top of the left forearm. Or right forearm. Strikes the palm. The left. And we have a chopping fist and seven star step. From here, both hands, the back of the hand, slap the inside of the thigh to shock the chi of the lower leg. Breathing in by the side of the face. A double pushing pump. Breathing in as the palms open up to the side. The left foot slides in to the right. Left hand on top of the right palm. Exhaling down. Turning the head slightly to the left. Two steps forward. And I now reach to the beginning. And perform my salute here. This is a left hand fist. And I walk through pace. The next version I'm going to do the same form. Actually, we'll do as a training set doing both sides, thus we have 22 counts, and nice and easy, this up, and four stands, 
One. Bow and arrow stand. Two. Cap stand. Three. Crane stand. Four. Kneeling stand. Five. Transition move. Twist stand. Six. Turn back out. Sixty forty stand. Seven. In, up, shin chopping hammer. Eight in a post stand. Three collar stand. Punch down, close course, ten, and seven stars, eleven. To the other side, and flat this punch, one. Upper block, upper cut, two. Cast dance to sun fist punch, three. Rolling thunder back fist, four. Elbow smash, five. Transition. Hook fist. Six. Sixty forty stance and expanding fist. Seven. In up. Shin chopping pose. Eight. Hamas. Shin chopping strike. Drilling fist. Three powers. Planting fist. Balance punch. Close fork. Seven stars. Chopping palm and fist. Shock the chi in the leg, deep inhale, push out, exhale, breathe in, inhale, exhale down. And another variation on training of this same form is simply to do one of each of the counts on left and right side. Now, as you train, you also can do more than one, eight or ten, and then move on to the next one. That's up to you. But how many repetitions do you Stay constant all the way through. Don't just do like, I'm going to say I'm going to do 10, and then I wheel down and start doing 6, and then later on I'm only doing 3 by the time I get to the 11th cast. If you're going to do 10, do 10 all the way through each cast. This one is one on each side, all the way through again, using the same idea. Number 1. Number 2. Number three. Number four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten, eleven, eleven, ten, six, thirty, two, one. 